Hey, it's Mr. Peace. I'm here at Maggie B Elementary School in Sterling Heights, Michigan, part of the Warren Consolidated School District. I'm at the intersection of Knowledge Highway and Caring Crossroads. And we had programs today on diversity, the need for human kindness. And I'm right down this hallway where they have a lot of different posters and murals, uh, just different sayings that talk about diversity, right? Which is our differences, both on the outside and on the inside. But we need to welcome all of those differences, right? We need to show compassion, tolerance, uh, whether we're different races or ethnicities, if we speak different languages, uh, if we, you know, have different things that we're born with, right, that are different from other people, we still look to accept everyone, right, to include everyone. It's all about inclusion. It's all about family, you know, here at this elementary school, too. I love this mural behind me, too, a lot of hand prints showing the different sizes of us, you know, because all of us are different. If we were all the same, that'd be very boring, right? It's very important that we... Uh, embrace diversity because we can grow so much because of it. And it says down here too that in diversity there is beauty and there is strength, right? And that's so true, right? And that was what we really tried to instill today in the presentation for all grades. And this was all about really trying to focus on what it meant to just have a more open heart uh, as it relates to really seeing everyone for who they truly are, right? Seeing them the same way that you see your own best friend, right? This was building on my first visit here a few years ago when we talked about bullying and looking at someone's heart first, right? Before anything else. And this took it up a level today where we did focus on diversity, you know, not just the outside differences, but what's on the inside too, our talents, our abilities, our gifts, that we also look to accept all of those as well. And once we respect that, then we start showing this world a lot more kindness, right? My shirt that I wear for this assembly says, Need Human Kindness. There's a peace sign inside the heart. That's where peace has to begin. So through a series of heartfelt stories, some motivational videos, some positive music, uh, a hand motion rap too about kindness, I was able to, you know, really kind of hammer home these concepts of knowing that we need to show a lot more love and that type of love is unconditional love, right? Which means that there's love without any conditions. If someone's taller than us, shorter, wider, thinner, wears glasses or doesn't, different skin color or not, is in a wheelchair or not, we can still choose love, right? And it's so important to understand that at a young age and very encouraging, inspiring that a lot of students said, hey, Mr. Peace, you know, something you shared really hit home, really touched my heart during those pin drop moments. And that's what I'm always looking for, right? Our ways that we can connect, uh, you know, really kind of deepen that message that I'm, tr that I'm, that I'm conveying uh, to them that it reaches their heart right hits them at the heart level and so that's what happened today and just so so honored to be back here getting to speak uh, to the young people to the staff and really talk about this important important message further you know this shirt has two people inside because we talk about diversity and showing kindness that it's not just appreciating our own diversity and you know showing ourselves kindness but we have to go out and show that to others too right for as much as we give we have to know that we can receive that gift as well. And once we do in our heart, then we want to give more, right? Then we want to spread kindness even more. And that also means that we need to understand our worth and our value, which ties into this. All of us with the lines on our hand have the letter M, right? I trace one of mine here. And sometimes a faint line connects, but we have at least one on each hand. That M I say stands for miracle, upside down. W stands for worthy, that we are beautiful miracles, worthy of love to both give it and receive it. But we have to buy into that, right? We have to see that in ourselves because so many students I speak to, they don't see that, right? Or they've never been told that or they need a reminder of that. And so the students really got that today. And when they can see their own value and worth right in front of them, be able to appreciate their own reflection when they look in the mirror, uh, that's, that's huge. And again, just really warms my heart uh, to be able to speak on such a relevant topic uh, as the one that we did today and going into the new year uh, that we can really choose to embrace that diversity fully and really grow from it, right? That's really my past and uh, my experience with it is that I've embraced it and as a result I've grown so much uh, because of it, you know, all the different cultures and backgrounds, uh, people from different walks of life that have really left an impression on my heart. 
just like everyone here did today. So thank you again for letting me share my heart. Have a great rest of the school year. Hope to see you again soon. Until then, though, and as always, make sure to hit the subscribe button you'll see pop up on the screen. You can also check out this playlist for some additional motivation. You can also visit my website by clicking on the peace sign symbol on your phone, tablet, wherever you're watching this video to track my journey across this country as I continue to heal America's heart one school at a time. Peace.